Welcome to another Tech Tuesday at FiTech. Today we're going to cover the importance of proper coolant temperature sensor installation. Some of the key reasons to have the temperature sensor in the correct location is for engine starting, accelerator pump operation, and for the cooling fan operation. For engine starting and accelerator pump operation, it's very dependent on the temperature of the engine and the intake manifold. So that's why it's very important to have that temperature sensor located in the hot side of the thermostat and not on the cold side. For the cooling fan operation, it's also very critical to have the temperature of the engine on the hot side in the engine so that we get an accurate reading of the engine and not the radiator. If the coolant temperature sensor has a fault and is detected by the computer, it will default to a, a ramping up coolant temperature reading in order to have a simulated sensor reading. That will also allow the cooling fans to operate and have some sort of good starting and accelerator pump operation. But you can check to see on the fault code list if the temperature sensor is reading correctly or not. If the coolant temperature sensor wires become broken or disconnected or pinched, the computer will read a fault code. It may be CTS high or CTS low depending on whether it's open or shorted. On this small block 350, the coolant port was already taken up by a gauge sending unit. So this manifold did not have any extra ports, so we added a spacer below the thermostat to read our coolant temperature. On this one, I didn't feel like putting it in the cylinder head because the cylinder heads do read hotter than normal. The factory temperature sending unit is often in the cylinder head as below. You can use that position for the Phytec temperature sensor, but do note that the temperature may read higher than normal. On many intake manifolds, the sensor port is a half inch MPT, but our sensor is 3 8 MPT, so you'll need to use the supplied adapter bushing to make the sensor fit. On LS engines, the proper location is in the front driver's side cylinder head in the factory location using a factory sensor. So the rear passenger cylinder head is not an ideal place to install the coolant temperature sensor because it reads a little hotter due to a reduced coolant and airflow. On air-cooled engines, we do recommend installing the temperature sensor in the oil rather than in the cylinder head as the cylinder head gets really hot. So the key thing with proper coolant temperature sensor installation is to have it on the engine side of the thermostat in the coolant flow. That'll give you an accurate reading and it'll ensure proper operation of the Phytec EFI systems. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below or contact tech support. Join us again next week for another Tech Tuesday at Phytech.